Hey y'all, what's good? I'm Chrissy and welcome or welcome back to my channel. One thing I feel like I've struggled with here on my channel is trying to be relatable. Even though I feel like, you know, we're relatable. I'm 29, I live at home, I plan on moving out this year, um, I work in healthcare, and I love influencing. And I think I've been scared to say that, you know, hey, I am an influencer besides being a healthcare worker and going to nursing school. That is something that I wanted to do. Not just struggling with being myself, but really going into this thing. And I feel like I really can go into it because you know, I am going to school. I am working. You know, there's other things in my life that are, that I focus on. Yeah, I just don't know if anybody can relate to that update your girl tested negative for covid so i am in the clear oh i feel i feel a lot better i'm still coughing a little bit so i'm still trying to get over that but i'm not super tired anymore in the bed just feeling down and out i'm feeling back on my feet definitely i got my flat iron plugged in because i need to do something with this hair i usually curl it but I don't want to curl it. I want it to look nice and flat, bone straight. So that's what I'm about to do. And then I'm going out axe throwing later. We're celebrating me being over COVID and being going back out into the world. So me and my really good friend, we're going axe throwing. And then I know we're going to go out to dinner later. So I'm really excited about that. Super excited. <laughs> On our way to X Adventures. We're in North Park right now and parking is a little crazy. So if you come to X Adventures, um, get to your just get there a little early because you need to look for a parking space. Okay? Okay. What's good you guys happy thursday it is nine in the morning almost 10 o'clock and where are we headed to target <laughs> i've always been a walmart girl always always and still will be still am a walmart girl but target has these vibes that are kind of like unmatched you know like when i was young going to walmart i was like oh wow you know vibe but you know target there's something in the air, there's something in the music, there's something in all the red and the white, there's something, there's something in that store. They have a scent box that just, you can't get away from because you're gonna smell it and you're gonna buy something. Over, over the limit of what you came for originally, so that's just that. <laughs> But we're actually going to Starbucks because I'm gonna look for some Valentine's Day stuff. Of course, TikTok got me, so I'm just like, oh my gosh, let's go look at all this cute Valentine's Day stuff. I don't really have anything super special I wanna buy, but um, if I do find some cute stuff, I guess maybe like, you know, for some girlfriends, I'll do like a little, a cute little basket, like Valentine's Day basket or whatever. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and head to Target and then I need to stop by Vaughn to get something for my mom real quick. Have you guys ever had those like cordial, cherry cordials? Where there's like a a cherry on the inside, you know, it's covered in chocolate with a little cherry and like filling on the inside. Have you guys ever had those? Um, if you like those, let me know because I'll get some for you and my mom. Just let me know how many boxes you want down in the comments, okay? Okay. All right, y'all, let's giddy the fuck on up. Y'all, oh my God. I can't believe I'm such a fucking crybaby bitch, oh my God. You guys, I just checked my phone because I just had a regular noti Instagram notification. I didn't tell you guys, but I was doing some videos for LYS just for them to produce, but they were also doing a um, kind of like a contest where they're choosing 10 people to become a part of their PR list. 
and they just made an announcement the first two people to be a part of their PR list and I am the first person out of two they picked me and another guy I just can't believe it like that was one of my goals and I set out to do it and I just tried to really make my content really really good one of the things I did was look at their page and like okay what kind of content are they are they reposting what are they reposting in their stories what are they what are they liking what are they interested in I just kind of like tried to re-strategize and like it's working out like slowly but surely things are happening and okay it's time to start crying I gotta but I just got home from Target. Um, I'll do a little Target haul or whatever. Um, I don't want to show everything because I got some Valentine's Day gifts in there. But um, yeah, let's hop inside the house. Um, yeah, let's go inside the house. Hey y'all, I was just about to put away the stuff that I got from Target. But my camera was literally set up for me to show you guys. So I said, let me just go ahead and show them. But yeah, this is the little basket right here, you guys. I love that it has two handles and um, I just like the little color detail of the handles but I just love the whole thing love the whole thing Target $5 section or dollar section has me in a chokehold literally chokehold love this three dollars this basket was five okay this was three. Oh my gosh y'all i have so many lip glosses that i just use basically i use a new lip gloss or a lip something for my lips every day and this is what i'm gonna keep them in because i rotate stuff so much also you can't beat the little beauty section that they have in target the no mustache they didn't have those little wax things i think i might still have more of those actually you guys take a look at this right here this is a little facial razor i got this before and i used it and never cleaned it so i just threw it away so i picked up another one i think this was about like 10 bucks this is super cute this says it's a precision facial razor, so you can use it to shave your face, but I usually just like shave my little mustache or shave around my eyebrows. This is really good, I like it. Plus, you know, it's cheap, it's on the go, you can pick it up at Target. And something like this, it's in this little travel case, you can use it for that, put something else in there. I think this would be perfect size for traveling, like on an airplane. These Mighty Patches, I'm gonna tell you guys something. If you get the pack of, what is this? This little pack right here is a pack of 12. Same price as the pack of 24. So if you go to Target and you go to the little section where they have the hero patches, or if you go to the little travel section, I'm gonna tell you the travel section does kind of get you. You so you gotta have to actually go to the brand section and see what's up. Literally 24 pack, seven dollars, the same price as this small one. Oh yeah. Give me the big ones. Don't even play with me. Okay, okay. Good for just, you know, on the go, but I mean if I'm if I can get the big ones and they're the same size as these, like come on, come on. Get them before they realize that they price them the same, so and these really work. I really like these. Picked up some other stuff, but I can't show you because they might be Valentine's gifts for people watching. But, um, yeah, y'all, this basket is too cute. Too cute. Another thing I picked up was this planner right here. The only thing that was different between these planners was the days, the two last days on the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Instead of having two small boxes here, they had their own section. So, um... Up here it says notes. They just added more days instead of having a note section. And they had more a bigger note section somewhere else, if that makes sense. But I like this one, so I'm going to hang on to it and use it for the rest of the year. I really wanted to show you guys this because I want to start using it. I was literally about to put stuff in this basket, take stuff out, put it away, and get started using this right now. But I wanted to show you guys first. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up tonight. You guys have a good night. I'll chit chat with y'all more tomorrow. Why is this happening? Why did they leave?
Hey y'all, what's good? Happy Sunday. Hey y'all, this morning I tried something a little different when it comes to vlogging. Comment down below, let me know if you like it, if you enjoy it. It was a little bit different and it takes a little bit more time just getting like the whole setup. And yeah, that's just one of the things that comes along with vlogging. It takes time to get the setup for stuff. You just gotta be prepared, just gotta be prepared. Y'all, church service is going on and it's getting good. He's talking about getting vulnerable and Jesus, we, y'all, if y'all are not watching Transformation Church, I definitely suggest you watch it. Last Sunday, Pastor Mike put spit on this man's face. Granted, it was his own brother, but still. Germs. COVID. I don't know. I just put up to Las Katrinas. I'm about to meet my girl, Sarina. Thank you. Hey y'all, what's good? I'm back home from eating out with Serena. I had the corn ribs, the corn elote ribs. They were good. And then they had these roll tacos. The roll tacos were good, skinny, but had really good flavor and they were filling. And then she had she had mahi mahi tacos and then she also had the corn ribs. I believe she said her, her tacos were good because she finished them and I finished my food, so it was good. If you're ever in San Diego, make sure you check out Las Tres Katrinas in Chula Vista Mall. It is right next to the Navy Federal. Also, I'm on the PR list for LYS Beauty. I think I told you guys that, but I was so emotional. I was so in the moment. I'm not sure if I... I'm not sure if I'll keep it in the vlog or not, but if not, this is the announcement. Your girl is on the LYS PR list. <laughs> so I don't know what the next step is. Um, I'm excited though. They're going to email me. I'm sure they're going to send me a whole bunch of stuff. So uh, I'm excited. I'm excited. And I already know who my cousins are. I already know who I already know who's there. Who was shooting with me in the gym? Who was cheering me on in the gym? We going to the top. Right to the top, baby. Right to the top. Taking you with me. Um, also, I don't think I told y'all, but I'm a lash ambassador for Lab Lash. Okay, they're launching. They've already launched. Y'all, y'all should check out these lashes that I'm wearing. Like, oh my god, let me get let me. Y'all see these lashes? Look at that. Look at those lashes. Those are bomb, super bomb, okay? So I think I can be a little like transparent to any other influencers out there. Do the best you can. Yeah, I just wanted to throw that in there. Make it work for you. Don't compare yourself. Talk to me about talking to me too. Talk to me about talking to me too. 